All right, guys, check this out. I'm going to show you this quick video here. These, right there. That's dust caps. So, you have your dust caps. When you're replacing your spindle bearings, you can notice your old bearings right here. Well, that's not a good example. Here's one. This bearing has dust caps on it. They don't remove them. So essentially you can't get the grease in there. Um, that's why this mower with only 122 hours, one of the main culprits these bearings go out so young is because they forget well, I don't know if they forget or they just choose not to remove the dust cap. So, it's quite simple. You have your pick here. Uh, you see how both sides have a cap. You simply get underneath it, pop one off. So now you have the exposed bearing. You do that right before you put it in. You put that side inside the hub, just like we did here. Um, and you have your dust cap on the outside, exposed on the inside, and then that's how when you use this greaser right there, or here, or over here, um, that's how the grease actually enters the bearing. If you don't remove the dust cap, no grease gets in there, causing these to wear out a lot quicker. So, um, if you're replacing the bearings on your John Deere or any other like equipment, Check to see if these dust caps are removed. If they're not, pop them out, put them in, and I bet the bearings will last a good bit longer. So that's a quick tip. Uh, that's all I'm going to do for this video. It's been a while since I posted one, but I figured this was a very valuable piece of knowledge I learned over the years someone passed on to me. Like, share, subscribe. Let me know if you want any more uh, content or maybe how to actually replace these bearings if you need. Thanks. Talk to you soon. Peace.